Hey, horse racing enthusiasts. This is John. Today's Sunday, uh, the 18th of September. And uh, just flying back uh, from a long week of traveling, both for work and, and, and a bit of pleasure. Um, and But one, uh, just in my first connected uh, flight, um, I had a uh, sense that I kind of spotted something out on the the sixth race in Belmont. So I wanted to reach out to all the horse racing enthusiasts and give you a sense of what's going on. So it's really the sixth race at Belmont. It's a uh, maiden special weight, 72, seven furlongs. Um, and it's for two-year-olds and we're on the dirt. And I think, uh, the, you know, the favorite and maybe the speed of the race is a horse by the name of Ye Ye, the, the eight. Um... So I think the eight should be part of your sort of your your um, your bets for today uh, in this race. Anyway, um, I also like the five. He's a close closer. So he's what I mean by that is kind of they hang hang up front, and you know sometimes they have a little extra energy at the end of the race, and they're, they're able to pass the rest. I rads the jockey on that five. Uh, the name is Forbidden Secret. So I think I've bet on that before up at Saratoga. Uh, but the horse that I'm really kind of focusing in on a little bit is going in style, right? This is the horse's uh, second time out. Um, last time out was um, less than stellar, but I think got some uh, experience out of this. Again, these are young horses, and they um, um, gain a lot of experience out of this process. And uh, I feel like one of the th one of the signals that I see here is that the trainer, uh, who I think is. Uh, um, McPhee, I think it is, uh, is putting uh, Flavory and Pratt on the horse. So uh, in, to me, you know, when we're doing the handicap, we're looking for what, where's the hot horse here? Where, is there a horse that's live that, um, and what indications do we have of that? And, you know, putting Flav on, Flavory and on this horse, the six, going in style in the sixth race, I think is a little curious and uh, I would say worthy of a win bet uh, for me. Uh, so I'm going to put, uh, you know, a win bet together, I'll probably 10 to win on the six, probably going to be somewhere in the neighborhood of um, eight, eight to one, something along those lines. I think if we want to cover ourselves, we look at um, an eight, six exacto, or maybe a try with the eight, five, six, seven. So that's the six race. I like the six, but we could also go with a try eight, five, six, seven, or an exacto eight, six. Next, I'd like to uh, bring you out to sort of the, the, the race of the day out at Belmont. Well, it's Belmont at uh, Aqueduct, right? Uh, they're doing work at Belmont, so they're keeping the meet named Belmont, but they're putting it out on the Aqueduct track. Uh, we have a G3 Pebbles on the turf, one mile on the turf for three-year-olds. Um, again, I like uh, the six here. Uh, again, it's gonna be a long shot, um, but um, if you look at the running line, uh, the six ran pretty well last time out in a grade three. Uh, other horses in this um, group haven't really run in a grade three, although a lot of them have similar sort of speed figures. I figure this experience, this horse has learned quite a lot. It's Leah Marina is the name of the horse. So I think um, I like the sixth in the ninth race as well. And I'm going to put the six with um, the 12, five, and four. So the 12, five, and four. All ran in the same race. You know the old axiom, horses that run together, win, you know, place together. So um, I think I would do a try again. So I'm going to try to put it in order for you here. So I'm going to do a try 4, 5, 6, 12. And then I'm going to do a win bet on the 6th, and that's in the ninth race. I hope that helps. I'm in um, um, Charlotte um, Douglas Airport uh, connecting through. I had identified these uh, sort of two picks uh, during my... Um, you know, initial flight. So I wanted to get get with you and get online and send a video. So it's been a busy week, but um, I'm glad I was able to get at least one thing out and uh, look forward to any comments. If you like, uh, please subscribe or like um, these videos. And um, hopefully we have a couple of winners here and can start off the week in, uh, in great fashion. So thanks, host racing enthusiasts. Look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you. Bye.